an outsider, one that these mercenaries have also made. I gave their leader my reject for her army, but she grows impatient. It's time for you to take me out of here. Personal issues irrelevant. Here for the collectors. I see. Yes. Collector attacks have increased. A human concern. My requests were focused elsewhere. I acquired the knowledge to create one pure soldier. With that, I will inflict upon the Genophage the greatest insult an enemy can suffer. To be ignored. What did you get from the Collectors? I need whatever you know about them. They are strange. So isolated, yet very available when your sacrifice is big enough. I gave them Mini Krogan. I may have information for you, but the tech was consumed in my prototype. After I determined how to use it without killing the subjects. The deaths were unfortunate, but I only need one success to start the process. I thought the Krogan ideal was a return to the numbers that threatened the galaxy. We will not need numbers. My soldier is a template. It is a greater threat than all the phantom siblings that would have been at its flank. The galaxy still bears the scars of the Horde, but it will learn to fear the Lance. You're just as cruel and manipulative as those who released the Genophage on your people. Perhaps. But I will restore the Krogan, and my soldier will not provoke a nuclear response as a cure or horde would. My legacy is perfection, with each pure Krogan reaching higher by standing on our dead. They will exceed, but not forget. So you don't want to cure the Genophage? Contrary to what survivors claim, the Genophage does not produce strong Krogan. The only quality it filters is the ability to survive the Genophage. For every thousand stillborn, too many weaklings live. Every survivor is branded as precious. That's produced more cuddling than your collective human teats. <laughs> I say, let us carry the Genophage. Let a thousand die in a clutch. We will defeat it by climbing atop our dead. That is the Krogan way. Your search for the perfect soldier created a lot of failures. You don't care about them? I feel no one. My rejects are exactly what Jador asked for. She simply lacks the ability to command. They are strong, healthy, and useless to me. I need perfection. If a few thousand are rejected, so be it. My work will purify the Krogan. We will not be restored. We will be renewed. Your methods are extreme, but you know how to deconstruct a threat. Will you help us? Perhaps I can strike a deal to secure passage, but my prototype is not negotiable. It is the key to my legacy. That weak will. She'll kill my legacy with a damn valve. Shepard, you want information on the collectors? Stop her. She'll try to access contaminants in the storage bay. You could just start over like she plans to. What's the big deal? This tank is pure. It involved as much trial as data. Starting over will not duplicate it. It must survive. Jador will be with the rejected tanks. Kill her. I will stay and do what must be done. <laughs> All right, let's go do this. Time to kill Jador. Enter minions.
insane, delusional, unexpected. Hello, Jador. Are you not dead already? Doesn't matter how fast you get back up there. You won't be able to change the outcome, so that's why I'm not in a big hurry. Alright, now I'm kind of looking to see if there's any loot. And it doesn't really look like there's much. Alright, I guess we get you, since he killed himself. After all he's done, he was willing to die to save this thing? Must be valuable. Delusional. Unlikely one Krogan, however strong, could have impact Okir wanted. And... almost certain. Suggest leaving it. Afraid he'll make your genophage obsolete? No, but Krogan genetically dangerous, socially dangerous as well. Have enough enemies without adding this. Normandy, Okir is a no-go, but we have a package that needs retrieval. And he's a big one. Alright, we gained another level. Cloning facility destroyed, Okir dead, but his son was recovered. Loss of Okir could be a problem. We'll allow Shepard to decide whether to activate the Krogan. And we got a bonus to Krogan Vitality. Sniper rifle damage, credits, platinum, and that's it. makes sense, but I have concerns about waking it. Yeah, you've said that a few times now. A normal Krogan is dangerous. This one was created and likely educated by a madman. I see everyone's enjoying the new paperweight. Concerns? We don't know anything about it, Commander. 
I know. You don't find that interesting? Krogan fight well at close quarters. Perhaps awakening him in a confined space wouldn't be prudent. Noted. The cargo hold is safe enough while I decide what to do with him. Alrighty then. Let's go check our upgrades. Come on, game. Load it already. Thank you. AP sniper rifle, yay! Might as well get that. Okay. And before we go talk to everybody, let's go activate the uh, Krogan. Let's see if we have any messages first. Nope. Bet that's going to wait till I activate the Krogan as well. Oh, there's not a little thing for Edie in here, huh? I'm gonna reset for Apps, be right back. Alright, I'm back. The subject is stable, Shepard. Integration with onboard systems was seamless. Can he see anything in there? Does he know where he is? Unlikely. Current neural patterns indicate minimal cognition. Barring shipwide power loss, the nutrients in the tank could sustain him for over a year. Any idea how dangerous this guy is? He is a Krogan, Shepard. If you are asking whether he is actively hostile, I don't have the necessary data to answer. Okir's technology could impart data, not methods of thinking. The subject may know of his views, but would not necessarily share them. What can you tell me about this guy? Anything unusual? The subject is an exceptional example of the Krogan species, with fully formed primary, secondary, and tertiary organs where applicable. No defects of any kind, aside from the genetic markers of the genophage present in all Krogan. I cannot judge mental functioning. Stand by. I'm gonna open the tank and let him out. Cerberus protocol is very clear regarding untested alien technology. He's either a powerful addition to the crew or a time bomb. I'd rather deal with it now. Very well, Shepard. The controls are online. The switch and consequences are yours. Commander Shepard, and I don't take threats lightly. I suggest you relax. Not your name. Mine. I'm trained. I know things. But the tank, Okir couldn't implant connection. His words are hollow. Warlord, legacy, grunt. 
Brunt. Brunt was among the last. It has no meaning. It'll do. I am Grunt. If you are worthy of your command, prove your strength and try to destroy me. You wouldn't prefer Okir or Legacy? It's short. Matches the training in my blood. The other words are big things I don't feel. Maybe they fit your mouth better. I feel nothing for Okir's clan or his enemies. I'll do what I'm bred to do. Fight and determine the strongest. But his imprint has failed. Without a reason that's mine, one fight is as good as any other. Might as well start with you. Is it that easy for Okir's perfect Krogan to abandon his mission? Okir is just a voice in the tank. If his imprints are true, then he created something stronger than him. So he's not worthy of me. And if his hatreds aren't strong enough to compel me, they've failed too. I feel nothing. I have no connection. I have a good ship and a strong crew. A strong clan. You'd make it stronger. If you're weak and choose weak enemies, I'll have to kill you. Our enemies are worthy. No doubt about that. Hmm. Hmm. That's... acceptable. I'll fight for you. I'm glad you saw reason. Huh? <laughs> Offer one hand, but arm the other. Wise Shepherd. If I find a clan, if I find what I... I want, I will be honored to eventually pit them against you. Huh. <laughs> That's cool. Shepherd. Anything in your tank imprints that can make use of the resources we found? Hmm. Might have something I could put together. Don't know how useful it will be. And he gets his own shotgun. Shepard. Anything in your tank imprints that can make use of the resources we found? Nothing else I can think of. I'm no tech. Enjoy what you've got. Did Okir give you any imprints about the Collectors? I see blurry ships, guesswork about strength. Nothing to help pick a weak spot and tear. Okir spent all his time on old hatreds. Whatever he had, it was used up when he made me. What are your thoughts about our mission? I fight. Doesn't matter who for. What do you think about the crew? Good bunch if they stay out of my way. Dead bunch if they don't. Train them good if you want to take on collectors. Some of these aliens are too smooth. Huh. Just checking in. Making sure you're acclimatizing. Humans talk too much. Like the tank. Come back later. That's all for now. Shepard. Kind of reminds me of Rex. Only Grunt's a little nicer. I kind of like him better. I hear that Rupert is actually cooking some good meals lately. Yeah, right. That scunner couldn't serve a good haggis if his life depended on it. But all haggis tastes like ass anyway. Aye, but in the right hands, it can taste like mighty fine ass. <laughs> Alright, now the rest of the crew should have stuff to talk about. Let's uh, start back at the CIC. Talk to Kelly and Joker. And, uh... Morden, Commander, you Jacob. received a new message at your private terminal. Of course I did. I don't know what to feel about Grunt. My psych reports were for Oak here. We have no guarantees that Grunt is mentally stable. I get the feeling he just doesn't care about anything, including who lives or dies. Don't worry, Kelly. I wouldn't let him touch you. If there's any touching being done, you'd better be involved. Anyway, what's up? <laughs> is there anything I should know? You have unread messages at your private terminal. Anything else, Commander? That'll be all. Take care.
From Elusive Man, Shepard, I see you awakened Okir's Krogan, a dangerous decision, but you've got free reign on this operation. If you're certain he'll be a useful member of the team, you've got my support. We need every weapon we can get in this battle. If this grunt proves unreliable and has to be put down, don't lose the body. He, he's based at least partially on collector technology and could offer other useful genetic data, but then... But again, you are in charge, okay. Speaking of that, we have a new look for Grunt, which we should add before I forget. Oh, wow. That's different. Kind of cool. I'll have to go back and see him. Check that out. Hmm. What can he use? Concussive shot, incendiary ammo, fortification, shotguns, and assault rifles. Okay. Cool, cool. I'll have to make sure he's using his shotgun that we just gave him through upgrades. Uh, Grunt. Geth Plasma Shotgun. No. You get this. Because it's specifically for you. And then you can keep that. Come on. Okay. All right. Commander, can I help you with something? I'm more interested in just talking for a bit. Already? I'm not big on forcing these talks, Shepard. Let's do this later. We'll talk later. Commander. Hopefully somebody has something to talk about. Shepard, how can I help? Have you got a minute to talk? Not at the moment. Think I've unlocked collector interest in humans. Wait, no. Only one heart. Krogan have two. Scratch that. Anything else? I'll let you work. We'll be here if you need me. Never mind. Maybe they won't have anything to talk about. I don't know. I kind of thought activating Grunt would activate their new dialogues, but apparently so, not. Badly. How are you going to spend your next furlough? You really think we'll have another shore leave? Of course. Shepard's forming the best team this galaxy has ever seen. We're going to kick some ass. I'm sure you're right, Matthews. Joker, you usually have something fun to say. You collect stray cats as a kid? Because we really needed a Mega Krogan, so thanks for dragging them home. <laughs> I assume everything's going well up here? This thing wants to fire me over a joke! Okay, I said I'd flash the AI core, but I was kidding. And we'd only lose a few systems. Nosy ones. To clarify, human resources adjustments are not actually under my authority. Then why? Why are you always picking on me? My replies were intended to provoke, though not to cause distress. Your reactions are atypical of most humans. You are interesting. She pushed your buttons to get a rise out of you. About time you were on the receiving end. Yeah, great. I just got worked by the intercom. It was not my intent to breed hostility, Mr. Morrow, but you did instigate our interaction. Okay, but think of it this way. Shut up. <laughs> Uh, it was pretty awesome. Uh, all right. That's it for now. See you, Commander. Miranda and Garrus and um, then we'll go check out Grant's outfit, I guess.
stop by Kasumi and Zaid, but they're not going to have a lot to say, as usual. Maybe nobody will have anything to say, really. Who knows? Thank you, Commander. Rupert put the new supplies to good use. You're welcome. Garrus! Shepard, need me for something? Have you got a minute? Can it wait for a bit? I'm in the middle of some calibrations. Talk to you later, Garrus. I'll be here if you need me. I am disappointed in my crew. They have nothing to talk about. That is annoying. Commander, what can I do for you? Do you have a minute, Miranda? There's a lot to do, Shepard. Maybe another time. I'll let you work. Of course, Commander. Oh, this has been a big fat waste of time. Oh, Kasumi! Anything? Anything at all? Anything? Hey, got a minute? Not a lot of people go in and out of Dr. Chakwa's office, other than to get medical attention, I mean. I hear you shared a drink with her. That's really nice. I imagine with all that's happened, old friends are becoming a luxury. Gabby and Ken would make a great couple. I just doubt they'll ever realize it. The Normandy runs so quietly. I'm not used to hearing my footsteps when I walk. Come back later. I'm sure I'll have more to talk about. Hmm. Alright, let's check out Grunt's outfit. Then we'll go back up to the CSC and that'll be it for this set of videos. Shepard. Oh, that's cool. He has a little eye thing, too. Just checking in. Making sure you're acclimatizing. Humans talk too much. Like the tank. Come back later. He looks pretty cool, actually. That's all for now. Shepard. That's neat. Nothing from them. Back for more. Doesn't matter who you are. You got a gun in your face, chances are good you'll do what the other man says. Only two types don't buckle at that point. Train killers and psychopaths. A lot of people can't tell the difference. I was shadowing this rookie on an infiltration run to an eclipse base on Tatus. Good kid, but he had no business handling a rifle. In the shuttle on the way down, he puked in his helmet. We hit some turbulence, and with all the crap sloshing around, he thought he'd been shot in the head. Went back to the Alliance. Here he's a governor now. I should let you go. Talk more later, Shepard. All right. So back to the CIC. No messages for you, Commander. Yeah, two more points. 
I think I'll save it to max up the combat drone we have. Seems fairly useful. So we'll wait on that. Let's make a permanent save. Thanks for watching, boys and girls. I am the good old gamer, and we've been chilling out with some more Mass Effect 2 on Sarah Shepard's Epic Adventures. We now have Grunt, Krogan, on our team. Fantastic. Next time, we will go after the convict. Stay tuned for that. Bye for now.